Blessed, most merciful Heavenly Father, I come before you humbly, Lord, and I beg and I plead, Lord, you give me the courage, the will, the words, the wisdom to speak, what you've put in my heart to speak. I pray in Jesus' mighty, mighty name. Amen. I am just the dust of the earth, and no one is beneath me. And the only thing that's special about me is that I am forgiven, and I am God's dirt. I said many years ago, I said that we were entering the time of sorrows, the birth pains. And I said, just like birth pains, our calamities would come quicker and quicker and come closer and closer together and get stronger and stronger, just like birth pains. Did I lie? Look at the world today. Look at, at the shape it's in. It's only going to get worse. It's only going to get worse. It's prophecy unfolding. It's prophecy unfolding. And if you read, if you read this book, it'll tell you. It'll tell you what's coming. It'll tell you what's happening and why. So I encourage people to read their Bible, to get in the Word of God. And I want to warn you that now is the time. Now is the time to get in the saving grace of Jesus Christ. Because nothing else, nothing else can save you except for Jesus. The only way to survive what's coming is to not be here. In other words, being raptured. And we love you all so very much. You all are a gift from God to us. We love you all so very much. And we keep you all in our prayers. We're getting down to the wire in this thing. The rapture is so close. It's so very close. We're right at the finish line. We're right there. So stay strong in the faith. And I know, I know a lot of people are having hard times right now. Difficult times. And I know that. And, and we're having difficulties too. So you're not alone. You're not alone. And we keep you all in our prayers. We love you all so very, very much. But just, just stay strong in the faith. Stay in the Word of God. And, and trust and believe in Jesus Christ. And, and trust and believe in His promises. Because Jesus has never lied. He's never lied. He's never lied. And he will, he will return one day to take us home, just like he said he would. So we are to remain faithful and true. And we are to be in prayer and looking up for that blessed hope, that great catching away. And we will see you. We will see you on the streets of gold on that day. We will look for you there. God bless you. God keep you, each and every one, in his loving arms, just like he held me. Just like he held me. And that's why I do all that I do, so that I can get back into those loving arms where I once was. And that's, that's my goal, is to get back into those loving arms again, back where I belong, and back where you belong as well. Back home. So we keep you all in our prayers, and we love you. We love we you love so very, you so very much. much. And every one of you are a gift from God to Amen. us. And we love you so very much. Amen. God bless you. God keep you. Is our prayer. Amen. Amen.